Hey guys, it's Jen. Uh, we did a thrift store run yesterday, among other runs, um, and we found some really cool stuff. I wasn't expecting to find as many cool things as we did, but I'm glad we went. We found this really gorgeous white wooden storage bench. It's got the lip around the outside. We could put a pad in here for seating, but I probably won't. It was only 20 bucks. Um, the only thing on the inside is the hinge is broken, but my husband can fix that. So we bought this, we're gonna clean it up, and my daughter's gonna use it for her dolls. And we actually, we had a full car load yesterday, so we put stuff in here in the car. <laughs> Um, we found this cute little build and grow little, um, oh goodness, what are these called? Tool belts? I think it's called the tool belt. Super cute. It was $2. It's brand new, never been used. Um, and kids love to be daddy's helper, so I'm sure they'll love that. Picked up a couple of these. They only had two that matched. They were 75 cents. They're in good shape. I checked. I couldn't find any chips or anything wrong with them. So there's two of those found these baskets. Um, they're in pretty good shape. I want to uh, put just like plastic bags or something in them and use them as little waste baskets. I wasn't sure which one I'd want for which space so I picked up two of them. They're a little bit different sized. I could spray paint them white if I wanted but I might not. I might just leave them. We got this. I'm going to get it in frame here. <laughs> it is big. It was a dollar. It's in great shape. has a good seal in it. My boys saw this and were like, <gasps> Look, 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 look. They knew Kurt would love it. So we picked that up. Um, that'll be really good for um, like using to make homemade sodas. We grabbed this. I almost didn't get it. It was $2. I couldn't find anything wrong with it. It's just a really pretty glass pumpkin. I think it's supposed to be a candy bowl, but um, we may or may not use it for candy. I really like pumpkins. And I've been wanting one of these for a while. So we grabbed that one. And this really pretty um, canister has this little thing here. I mean, you can't really hold it by that, so I'm not 100% sure whether it's there other than to maybe hold a little spoon that's not here. It was $2. The seal looked good. Um, I just need to clean it out. I'm not sure what we will keep in it. It's We have a bigger, like a big canister for sugar right now, so I'm not sure what I'm going to put in this one. But since it had a good seal and it's in such good shape, I wanted to grab it. We bought this. It is a really pretty plaid flannel. It was only $3. It's just yardage. It looks like it's in really good shape. It has never been washed. So we're going to use that to make pajama pants for the boys, probably. Maybe tobacco quilt. I'll have to see how much is there, but the goal was pajama pants. Found this yarn. I am a knitter and a crocheter. And I went through the yarn. I go through the yarn every time in there, and they usually don't have anything that I want. But this was 50% um, acrylic, but then 50% fine merino wool, and it has a really nice feel to it. It's a beautiful color. It was a buck, so I picked that up and bought this. I don't know where I'm going to put it. I do like the picture. It's not 100% my style. It was $3, but the, the frame was just gorgeous. So even if I took the picture out and just kept the frame, it was worth it in my opinion. Um, but I might actually keep the picture. It's really pretty. We'll just have to see if it fits somewhere in the house. <clears throat> and we found this really pretty sheet. It was $2. It's like a vintage floral. I don't know if it's true vintage, but it's really, really pretty. And last time when I looked, if you saw my last haul, I didn't find one with this with the bright colors in it. I wanted to grab that. And this is like my favorite thing that I found. It was just sitting there on a shelf being ignored. Isn't that gorgeous? It was $2. I need to wash it up. There's nothing on the bottom, no identification. I have no idea if it's new or old or what it's. I don't know. But it's really, really pretty. I really like it. It might end up in the bathroom that we're redoing right now. Um, up on a high shelf where my kids hopefully can't reach it and break it. But And it's big. I don't know if it's showing up as big as it is. But So there's that. And then we picked up some baskets. This nice big one. I want to put this in our room as our laundry hamper. We don't typically have like like sopping wet laundry or anything like that. So I'm okay using a wicker basket in our room, but it doesn't have handles. And so 
I think I want to, I need to get an old leather belt for another project, but I think I might use that same leather belt to put some leather handles on it. We'll see. I've been having trouble finding a good old leather belt. Picked up this basket. I haven't, oh, and this is $3. I haven't tried it yet. I want to see if it'll fit on the back of the uh, toilet upstairs as a um, toilet paper holder, but I don't know if it will. This one was $2. So there with the measuring tape, like measuring all the baskets, trying to find one I liked. This is one of those like little fruit baskets. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with it. I need to fix the um, handle a little bit. It may just end up being for decoration. I'm not 100% sure. It was $2. They had another one there that wasn't in very good shape, so I left it. And then last but not least, there's this basket. It's really sturdy. It has nice, um, I think it's like, what, faux bamboo maybe? I'm not sure. Handles. It was 2 bucks. It's really nice. I love baskets when you use them all over the house. So that is what we picked up at the thrift store. We hope you guys are having a great week. Um, please comment below with your very favorite thing to look for at the thrift store. We'll talk to you all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.